So, good morning, Thursday, 15th November. Just leaving Camp on Thumb here. Nice and early. I'll do about 15 kilometers and then stop and have breakfast on the way. Nice start to the day here. That was a nice shortcut through the countryside, now back on the main road here. And the view at the side of the road is still beautiful. Okay, this place is called The Stop. Look at this place on Highway 6. Looks like a place for us. Let's go and have a look at this. <laughs> Amazing contrasts there are. You can see there's a lot of new development going on together with traditional way of living. What a nice place. <laughs> okay, here they have English breakfast with all that things you need to have in a breakfast. Oh wow, breakfast. this is like heaven. Okay, let's go. Look at this. My goodness me. <laughs> because they're Englishmen that owns this place. Yeah, that is he, why English. And he knows how to make English breakfast. Advertises the coolest place on the road here and we agree. Wow. Mm. Even have a nice basket with bread and jam. For a cyclist, life doesn't get better. Okay, so that was a really nice place to stop. Never expected that this morning. But now it's uh, time to get on the road. Let's uh, have a look what it looks like further down the road here. Allow me to show you something. <laughs> So far it's a very easy country to cycle in. It's very flat and uh, very little wind. Just uh, hot but not too bad. I'll be moving here, nice breeze and it's okay. Plenty of places to get water as well, so it's uh, quite easy going really. What is going on here? Same again here. 
families involved. Children, grandparents all working in the same shelter there. Now we just stop to have a look what they're doing here. Oh, they're heating. There's some kind of voice, I think they're heating up there. And the second will get thrown into there. They'll start hammering away again. Oh, oh. And the hammering starts. The end result is this here. Uh... Really is a beautiful country to cycle through. You can imagine maybe 10, 15 years ago when this was just a dirt track, maybe it felt a bit more authentic. I did a nice road here with houses at the side of them. They look like they're from a completely different era. But uh, easier for us to cycle here now. It's pretty fast, really. <laughs> Town of Stone. I'm not sure if that's how you pronounce it, but it's a place where we could stay this evening. It's only 50 kilometers we've done now today. It's only quarter to 12. I think there's a better hotel here than where we could stay this evening to carry on with. We'll see, maybe it's a bit too early to stop. Then we'll have an easier ride tomorrow to see and reap. This is the center of Stone here. There's a hotel there where we could have stayed, but Town's not anything special, it's not worth spending the afternoon here, so we'll carry on now. Right. Well, this is a typical place, we see the side of the road where they have cold water in these uh, containers there, with the ice in the bottom, but it's just cold. And, yeah. Buy a few snacks and things, they have these many places at the side of the road here. Another nice place to stop for lunch. It's a mixture of European style places and traditional places. You can take your pick really what you feel like. A huge fish down here. From China. It's very big creature. It's like when it's come up it look like a whale, not like a fish. Look like a dinosaur, it's a been in the dinosaur time. Very huge. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's yeah. have some lunch. Amazing, really. A lot of these houses, children are just waving to us, saying hello. I haven't caught many of them on film. I've passed it off with the camera today. Again, in 20 years time or so, I see the difference. I'm pretty sure there'll be a huge difference. A lot of these uh, simple shacks we see will surely be replaced by nicer houses. There are already a few sprouting up.
Kevin. <laughs> okay, we're going to see Reap Province. Getting closer, should be there tomorrow. Town of Sea and Reap. Well, this is the poorest of the three countries we visited in Southeast Asia so far. But uh, interesting because this is the country where people seem to be most happy and smiling. So many friendly, happy faces we see on the road here. Really nice just to cycle down here and say hello to everybody and see their faces. We're just entering the town we're going to stay. Camp on the Dye, I think this is called. 89 kilometers we've done today. That's okay. Took it quite easy as well, enjoying our breakfast and long lunch. Not too difficult. Okay. This is where we're staying this evening. Actually, it sounded worse than this on the internet. It's not too bad actually. So this is a nice simple room here in Cambodia. Sok San Kestas. Perfect. So these are the kind of rooms that are perfect for touring bikes because the full of room is here. Unload the bike right here and keep the bike in the room. And That's easier been easier than camping. And water. That is the best thing here is water. Good boy. Mm, very nice. <laughs> sure, that's all we need as a touring bike. Yeah. Nice and simple, just what we need. Okay, so there are not many options of places to eat here in this town. And kind of a real Khmer Cambodian restaurant here. We kind of choose from some of the pots over there what you want, and then uh, she brings you rice and yeah, what we found in the pots and uh, tea with ice. So that's the way to do it here. <laughs> end for today and today we have been in the countryside and on the main road and uh, 90 89 kilometers today there's been uh, yeah, plenty to look at all day with nice smiling faces from the children and uh, nice houses and things to look at on the side of the road yeah so a good day best part was probably the breakfast it was extremely <laughs> good yeah good <laughs> never, english breakfast we never expected that but uh, so we could we made the most of that while we while we could. So very good, nice nice day on the bike. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> uh, tomorrow, exciting day. We are going to Siem Reap, and that's the town where Angkor Wat is. So that will be a good yeah. day. That will be excellent. Yeah, it's only about sixty kilometers, so we should be there by just after lunchtime. Yeah. So. That'll be nice. Yes. Uh, so. <laughs> so uh, yeah, yeah, that's all for today. See yes. you tomorrow. Bye. Mm. Ha 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 ha.